Do you want to sell your coins, paper money, notes, valuable bills and stamps online? You can publish your ads for free on our website, thecoines.com. For mobile users it's much easier publishing coin ads using our Coines app. Hey everyone! In this episode I'm going to talk about several highly elusive penny issues. Together we will find out what makes them so valuable these days. So hit subscribe button below this video and without much ado let's get started. The 1972 Lincoln Penny with double die obverse is a coin variety with a doubling effect on the letters and numbers on the obverse, front, side of the coin. It is one of the most famous double die varieties in US coin collecting. The doubling on this coin is quite noticeable and prominent, making it a highly sought after and collectible variety. The doubling affects the date, 1972, the letters of liberty, and the numbers and letters of in God we trust. While not as rare as some other coin varieties, the 1972 Lincoln Center double die obverse is still considered a valuable and desirable coin, especially among collectors. This gem in mint state 67 plus red condition, proven by CAC, ended up selling for $17,437.50 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. Here is 1925 Lincoln Penny in Mint State 65 plus red condition. The 1909 SVDB Lincoln Cent is often called the King of Lincoln Cents. However, despite being abundant in low grade, the 1925 D is far scarcer in full red gem. Most mint state examples either have mushy strikes, browning, or spots, making this piece, which features none of those drawbacks, a remarkable survivor. With brilliant rose-red surfaces and an exceptional strike for this usually weak issue, it is an extraordinarily attractive coin fit for a top-notch collection of Lincolns. Sold on March 23rd for $7,200 at Stax Bowers. This is 1909 SVDB Penny in Mint State 66 Brown Condition. A richly original gem that exhibits vivid cobalt blue and pinkish rose undertones and dominant antique copper-brown patina. Fully struck with bountiful mint luster, this is an outstanding example of one of the most eagerly sought issues in the entire Lincoln Scent series of 1909 to date. Sold for $8,400 on March 23rd at Stax Bowers Auction. Here is 1931's Lincoln Penny in mint state 66 red. Exceptional quality for this perennially popular key date Lincoln Scent issue. Softly frosted surfaces with a sharply executed strike and lovely pinkish-orange color. From a mintage of just 866,000 pieces, the lowest for any cent issue from the Great Depression era. With much of the mintage remaining in government vaults until the mid-1930s, circulated examples have always been scarce. When the 1931S was finally released in quantity beginning in 1934, the limited mintage immediately attracted the attention of contemporary numismatists, who set aside large numbers of mint state coins. This one was sold for $2,400 at Stax Bowers Auction. Moving on to this 1936 Lincoln Penny with satin finish. Graded as PR65 plus red by PCGS. A vivid rose-orange specimen with solid gem quality and undeniable originality. First of the modern proof Lincoln Cent issues, the 1936 is also the scarcest with a combined mintage of just 5,569 coins for both satin and brilliant examples. Sold for $5,760 at Stax Bowers. Here is 1909 Lincoln Penny in mint state 66 plus red condition. What makes this penny valuable is that the mint mark S is punched over horizontal S, beautiful light rose surfaces are fully frosted in finish with razor-sharp striking detail and virtually pristine surfaces. FS1502 is a perennially popular RPM variety from the premier year of the Lincoln Scent series, represented here by a conditionally rare premium gem that is sure to sell for a strong bid. It was sold for $4,200 at Stax Bowers Auction. Thanks for watching guys. Your likes and subscriptions are highly appreciated. And if you have rare coins you can post them for sale on our website, thecoines.com. Take care.